Today, huh? Oh, yeah. What's what's at the Eastern Market? What do we got? Uh, today they have all kinds of artists and music and vendors like that and food. Food, food. Ooh. Food. Shit, five. All right, guys. Tell me this isn't a challenge to try to jump over this. It's just like right in the middle, right dead center. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> yeah, the Eastern Market's awesome. You just come here and get so many different options. So much food. Strict corn and elotes up there. A little pigeon buddy. Don't get much better than that. Pablo boat. But the amusement mecca that once was the Detroit Riverfront was right here. There was another park, Wolf's Amusement Park, Riverview Park on the other side. And then right over here behind me was Electric Park. One of the first parks to feature electricity, have lighting packages, dazzling displays of lights. So it's pretty cool thinking of what could have been, you know, Detroit's own Luna Park waterfront. But alas, it's all gone. What once was Electric Park is now occupied by a cute little butterfly garden and people out and about having good days and us walking around and no more amusement park mecca madness on both sides of the uh, the bridge here on Belle Isle's bridge out there in the distance. Kind of crazy when you think about it. And just over in the distance here on the other side of the bridge was a different amusement park. Now gone and filled with trees and everything else along the waterfront. Mecca that once was. 5-0! Five 5-0! -oh, five -oh. We had a false alarm of someone falling off the Belle Isle Bridge before we even got over to Belle Isle, everybody. They sent out like a whole bunch of jet skis. There's boats on the other side that people that were out here. Pretty cool little recovery effort and a bunch of people around. But yeah, we checked all of our footage. There was no one on the bridge. We're at the Belle Isle Aquarium and fun stuff around here. The aquarium and Scripps Whitcomb Conservatory. Temporarily closed, guys. <laughs> hey, he also built the Bobble Boat Terminal, too. <laughs> we got in here.
the aquarium here on Belle Isle is freaking awesome. I mean, every exhibit has fun facts in front of it. There's tons of like the conservation status, information about everything you're seeing. And I mean, just hundreds of them, like all down here. This place is really cool. Interesting, you can see all these cool fish. Scary fish everywhere. Scary fish. fun how do you feel about it guys you liked it did you like it i liked it it was hot in there though but yeah it was pretty cool there was like axolotls in there and weird lungfish and electric eels and basically anything you can think of in there it was in there oh yeah check that out the aquarium with belle isle 10 out of 10 The old entrance to the Belle Isle Zoo right here. Kind of crazy when you think about it, huh? Used to be a whole ass zoo here. Rotting away now. Let's see what's going on in here. Tickets. And here's where you would walk in to get to the old zoo. It's kind of crazy what's happened to it now. It's just overgrown shrubs everywhere. I mean, there's really nothing you can even get views of in there. that were excited about the Bob Love boat thing that said spring 2024 and now it's saying fall 2024. The infamous Bell Isle slide. It is time everybody. <laughs> no slide today. No slide today. Not open. Not open. No slide. Oh, there's a chipmunk down there by the feeders. Huh. Look guys, it's an albino turtle. <laughs> he's a red-eared slider, but he's technically an albino turtle still. Go. 
have a little boat experience here.